me switch this on over. Hey, Toxic's here too. Oh, Pod, praise the stream. Yes, um, we do have some spooky lighting here today to match the uh, scene that we have. So my history with this game, I started it a few years ago, probably like, I don't know, 2017, 2018, and I was terrible at it. So today is either going to go okay or very, very poorly. We will find out. Um, but regardless, thanks for being here. I definitely want to give this a go again. I'm going to be playing on the PlayStation 4 controller. Not really sure if that's the best way to go, but uh, I remember it being easiest for me back then. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into the game. I think I've only played probably six hours or so in the past. Um, so we're going to go ahead and do a new game. Any ideas on what to name the character? By the way, does everything sound all right? Let's see. I'm trying to remember what I went with last time. Um, I feel like I always went with something that had better survivability. Oh, Toxic. Well, you also have a good lurk. I appreciate it. Let's see. So Warrior will give us high strength and dexterity. Knight gives us high HP. I think I probably went with a knight in the past because I want to be able to survive. Among the Stars, thank you for the follow. Really appreciate it. Have you played this game before? Um, it's like I said, I've given it a go, and it's real hard. They don't lie. Uh, let's see. So knight, we got high HP, which I think I went with last time. Wanderer. I'm honestly not sure if I'm going to use a bow and arrow in this game. Historically, I'm pretty bad with bow and arrow. Um, so that's kind of low on my list. High critical hits and a master key. I don't even know what that means. Uh, let's see. High strength. Wielding hunter. Okay at close range. Sorcerer. I honestly don't know how much magic we're actually going to use. Pyromancer. Cleric. Hmm. Or we could be deprived of everything. <laughs> Even clothes. I don't remember this being here before. Maybe I blocked it out of my mind, I don't know. I think I am going to go with the knight, unless anybody else has any suggestions. So that's what I'm going to select for now. Let's see. Goddess's blessing sounds promising. It's kind of a last Hail Mary. Black Firebomb, though. I think I remember using it in the past, and it was super helpful. Hey, D-Gen. How's it going? I feel like I haven't seen you for a bit. Among the Stars says, I haven't played this game before, but I just came by to watch you. Squishy LOL. It's Christina, by the way. Oh my gosh! Blast from the past. <laughs> How are you doing? Let's see. Twin Humanities. That doesn't even tell us what it does for us, though. Tiny sprite. Binoculars. Don't need that. I feel like I'm going to regret saying that, but whatever. Uh, trinket, no effect, but fond memories, comfort travelers. So that one character already has the master key. Uh, tribal ring also seems promising. I lurk in the shadows for good folk fear to tread keep keepy. Dijen, whatever it is, I appreciate you. And Shen Rayenhes? Shen Ravenhes? I'm so sorry if I said that wrong, but hello. Welcome. And Baggles here too. Tribal Ring? That's what I was thinking. Either that, the Firebomb, or the Goddess's Blessing. And no one said anything about levels yet, so I'm assuming that they are A-OK. -okay. That's okay, I tried. Well, if you could tell me how to pronounce it, I would appreciate that. Um, and I think I have to use the mouse for this part for the name, but I am going to go ahead. Okay. Please let me do it. In honor of our Kingdom Come Deliverance playthroughs, I'm going to go ahead and name this person Henry. Okay. Can we click away, please? Did I break the game? Uh-oh. Sounds good so far. Thank you, Baggle. Enter. There we go. Okay. So let's go for physique. Um, I mean, 
I don't know what this does other than changing how it appears for us. Like, I don't know if you're a heavier person, you have more strength and uh, less stamina. I'm not sure. Shenri er Ness. Shenri er Ness. I will get used to that. Or I may call you Shen for short if you don't mind. Uh, everybody in here tends to have a nickname. That face is very intense. And see, the thing with Dark Souls also, I'm not gonna lie, it's like I want to know the lore. I want to know what's happening in these games, but uh, it's just so opaque to me. Like, oh, of course I know what a Delta Farmer is or a, a Stora Noble. I don't. Oh, rye. Dang it, rye like the bread. Okay, Shen, thank you very much. <laughs> Thanks for making that easier for me, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see. I wonder if we could try to make this look as close to Henry from Kingdom Come Deliverance as possible. That may be hard to pull off. Character creation is boss. Hey, Mint, how's it going? Covetous Shen, yes. Mad Queen, watch Vati's videos on YouTube. He does awesome DS lore. That might be worth it. That might be worth it for me to actually understand it a little bit better. Uh, let's just go ahead with this face. I don't even know what would make what would constitute an average face, honestly. Ooh, look at this hair. More like Shen from Wendy, We Homecoming Warrior. Okay. Oh, woo. I'm not sure if I've heard of that before. You'll have to remind me what it is. Oh, Mad Queen is hosting. I was going to say, I heard a notification. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Woo. It's a throwback. Woo Homecoming Warrior. Warrior. Was that a live action series or an anime? Oh, Papa Talk. Again with the gift subs. My goodness. You know what? Actually, uh, for people who are new in the channel, please let... Lend your eyes, I should say, to Papa Talk. He's an awesome person. He does a lot of good... Uh, VR games and horror games. Lots of good stuff on his channel. And we do one-shot Wednesdays of D&D. Ah. Okay, so character creation is going to have to be put on hold for a second because Papatak has redeemed doodle time. Oh, it doesn't need to be right now? I feel like it should be right now, though. Disney, Disney Channel original movie. Home homecoming warrior. I'm gonna have to check that out. So, this doesn't look like Henry at all anymore. I was gonna say really quick that typically whenever I play these games or at least give them a shot, I try to make them look like uh, Geralt from The Witcher. <laughs> so let's do that. Uh, but, Pop Talk, what do you request as your doodle? Dejan says he lent Pop Talks his eyes once and he returned them three weeks later, cracked and smelling like the state fair. <laughs> That's terrible. All right, Papa Talk, what do you request? My what? Oh. Okay, so maybe when we're done with him? When we're done making him? That's what I'm assuming. When we're done making our Dark Souls character, we will do a quick, quick doodle. All right. Thanks for being on the same page. Something else that's weirding me out too is uh, the filter that's over this person's face right now. I don't know. Like I know the whole page is supposed to look really leather bound, but it just weirds me out, especially when we're moving him. Maturity. Uh, I don't see much changing. Let's put him in the middle somewhere. Hormones. How is that different from mature? Oh, sorry. I saw the young and old and I got a little confused. Okay, I guess we'll keep it masculine, which apparently is changing his complexion. I don't understand. Don't understand. That's too tan for our Witcher, though. Uh, features, weak or strong? I'm assuming a stronger feature is like a stronger nose. You know, it's funny because character creation to me 
doesn't matter a whole lot because they wear uh, so much armor and stuff on top, you don't get to see their face. And most of the time, they look like a prune anyway. And Bleep, gifting a sub for Bagel. Thank you so much. Uh, take a look at Bleep's channel as well. He's a great person, and he does a lot of retro gaming. Very relaxing, very welcoming. Love it. Love it all the way. Well, I think, like, Bloodborne and some of the other Dark Souls games have more customization than this, unless I'm missing something. Am I missing anything? Hendrick, in order not to mix up the characters? That's a good idea. Let's change it. Oops. You always have good ideas, Pod. Hendrick. I spelt it right, right? Yeah. Okay. Oops. He looks like he is going to be ready for combat. All right. So let me switch on over to my face, I guess. And I did bring this. Uh, sorry, I don't have a uh, desk camera set up at the moment. I wasn't sure if doodles were going to happen today. Whoops. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Hype train? Who started this hype train? <laughs> Among the stars, you subscribed already? <laughs> this is too much. I don't know what to do with myself. <laughs> oh, I wish I had a hand cam so you could see what I'm working on. Ah, I promise I am drawing it though, I swear. Uh, let me see. Thank you so much for the subscription. I super appreciate that. You are too kind. Too kind to me. Um, okay, so... Just trying to see what size we should make our canvas. I'm not very good at doodling people. I have to give you that much. If you saw the thing from the incoming stream, I did doodle that. The, uh, Solaire. Praise the sun. Oh god. It worked. <laughs> it worked! Oh, Bagel, thank you. I'm so excited. <laughs> I love that. It finally, finally worked. And thank you! For my first hype train, this is insane. I've only been streaming for like 15 minutes. Oh my god. I don't know what to do. This is gonna be great too, if we uh, struggle in the game and someone congratulates me. I'm so glad we worked on it. All right, let me uh, draw this dude's face real quick from memory. Like I said, I'm telling you, I am terrible at drawing faces. That is a okay. Oops. I'm always hitting stuff. That's why I liked drawing Solaire, because, uh. Oh, God. Pop Talk, you're gonna regret redeeming your points for this. Um. I liked drawing Solaire because there was nothing for me to focus on in terms of his face. There was no. issue. That's something that I really have to practice. Oops. Well, let's see here. I'm going to try to be really quick with it so that we can move forward. And doodles are supposed to be pretty quick in nature, in my opinion. Alright. I think we're doing pretty good. Sorry, you can't see what I'm doing right now. I'll try to be quick. Quick, quick, quick. How's everybody's day, by the way? Happy Valentine's Day. Figured I'd celebrate with some good old Dark Souls. Oh, pop attack again? With the gift subs? Ah. Ikra Boost, welcome. Kwahi. I know you followed me before. Welcome. Sniffer, welcome back. Soft Kitty Mew Mew, welcome again. And Precursor, I know you were there for the Kingdom Come. Welcome. It is V-Day. Oh, Mad Queen, work was stupid busy. Well, I hope that uh, your drive home is going better than work. Don't deserve that kind of stress. All right. Just coloring on our... Uh, Hendrix 
Eric Sayer real quick. I love that we created his name together too. And I always yell, come on, Henry, with uh, our kingdom come, so this won't be much of a change. It'll be good. Make that a little bit bigger so I can get through this. Definitely mad. add more to it later, Papa Talk. But for now, this is what we're going to have going on. Let's do one more thing here real quick. really want to see this. Can you see it from here? Is that lighting up for you at all? There's our character. I really got to work on people. I know it's terrible. Sorry. We'll get better. Ask me to draw a Pokemon or something next time. Oh my god, again with this hype. Hype, hype, hype all around. Alright, let's get to the game. <laughs> I did, uh... So Shen, I picked Knight because uh, it had the most HP. Not gonna lie. If you have any other recommendation, you let me know before we finalize this. Oh my gosh, stop. <laughs> Among the stars, thank you. Thank you. Uh, hopes are too much. And as had subscribing to, this is ridiculous. All right, so Shen, do you have Okay. All right. If you don't have any other recommendations, we will go with it. And thank you again for all the support. Super duper duper appreciate it. Bagel again with a cheer. All right. Let's move past this character creation. Uh, by the way, I do have that Solaire waiting as a uh, a emo. So that's good. Thank you again for the cheer. I'll wait for that to stop before I start the game. <laughs> oh god, it may not stop. It may not stop. Yeah, Shen, I was asking if you have any recommendations before I finalize this character. So we went with the tribal ring, uh, went with knight. I don't think any, but anything else really matters. My goodness, folks. My goodness. This is too much. <laughs> oh, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Alright, Shen, so once again, if you have any recommendations, just go ahead and type them. I'll wait a little bit. <laughs> any particular playstyle that might be applicable? No. No, I'm usually just the type of person that I go straight in. Just melee, that's what I prefer, melee. Like if I play an Elder Scrolls game, I usually use a really heavy weapon. Uh, and yeah, I don't I don't think very much. I just go in there and I hope that I can be durable enough to survive. Thank you. <laughs> oh, thank you, Among the Stars. Love it. Okay, sounds good. And mint. I don't know. I've never used a bow and arrow in a Souls game before, so we'll see. All right, let's go ahead. Let's move forward with the story. In the age of ancients, the world was unformed. Oh my God! Blue shrouded cast again? by fog. With the gift subs, Lucifer, Morning Stars, a land Azadok, of gray crags, Arenza, Arch Thank trees. You. Thank you very much. And everlasting dragons. Uh, for folks who are new, we do have a Discord where we do. I also do a lot of gunpla builds uh, and just different gameplay throughs. And we've got a lot of chats going fire. on there, like anime and all kinds of stuff. Everybody's and super welcoming, fire. really nice. And I have a YouTube Game channel as well disparity. where I say, you know, all my past uh, gunpla builds and Heat gameplay and all that. And cold. Life and death. Sorry, I'm talking over the story. And of course, but it still doesn't make much sense. Light and dark. Love the voice acting, though. 
Then, from the dark, they came. <laughs> so Azhat's recommendation is and mostly try to spank bosses and stay sidestepping out of their attacks and the dodge flame. back for AoEs. Makes sense. Love the monsters in this game too. They look so good. Wee! Stop it! The first of the day. I appreciate it. Appreciate everything you do. Ooh. So As had as a soul scorn champ, maybe they the shouldn't watch this then. <laughs> and her daughters of chaos. Gwyn, the Lord of Sunlight. And his Lord. Uh, Shen, I so played this game forgotten. probably within the past five years, not recently, probably like not within the past two, three years. Uh, I got With six hours into it, lords, and it took me that long to beat the second boss, I believe. The so this may be really bad, but I think I've gotten better over time. Lords, I did start uh, Bloodborne on the PlayStation, and I was doing okay with it, so fingers crossed that this goes well. Mad Queen says, Who watches me play Demon Souls on the PS5? I'm not good. Okay. Well, I feel like we have a lot of people in here who could give me some good advice. And leave again. With all those subs. Killer Reaper, Agent, Angelo, thank you. Thank you so much. I don't even know what to do with you. Game audio may be touch loud. Thus began so. the age of fire. Thanks for letting me know. Is this any better? Is it but too low soon now? The flames will Hi. fade. Thank you, thank you. Is and this any better? Only dark will remain. Even now, Good. there are only embers. I appreciate it. And man sees not light, but only endless nights. Yep, that's what we're gonna look like, I think, from what I remember. And amongst the living are seen carriers of the accursed dark side. Oh god. Oh god. Pop talk, thank you again. And we thank you again. I feel like this is just what I'm gonna hear all the time now. That's alright. It's okay because this is gonna help yes, me out because indeed. I don't do too well with spooky games. This isn't too bad, but sometimes undead. it still startles me from time to time, so I think hearing this cheering in the background will help me stay calm. And thank you. <laughs> I haven't even done anything yet. I don't deserve all this congratulations. <laughs> I don't deserve it. Oh my gosh. People. People. Where they are locked away to await the end of the Oh god. I see what we're doing here. So for the next three minutes, this is what we're gonna hear. <laughs> uh. This. You know, I'm gonna love it if we hear that and I'm dying. That'll be great. That'll be great timing. I'm sorry for uh, talking over the whole story. Very sorry about that. <laughs> I know. Congratulations! Squawk! Oh, that penguin is something else in the show. Oh my god. Pop attack again with the gift subs. Stop it! Stop it, stop it, stop it. For Big Daddy, 4005, Sneaky Dingo, Rookie 0713, Joni Anta, and Soul, Sas uh, Soul Sentient, level 5. I'm gonna have to make more emotes now. Thank you. I'm assuming that's what that means. I can't remember. <laughs> okay, we're at the start of the game. See, this is what we look like now. We don't even look like a handsome person we created moments ago. Oops, okay. So an issue I'm gonna have for a little bit is since I'm using a PlayStation controller, this game has the inputs for an Xbox controller, but luckily I prepared myself and I drew a little uh, map for myself here of the buttons. So if I mix things up, that's what's happening. Do I have a little, s oh, I have a broken sword. That's helpful. What was that? 
Okay. Honestly, can't remember the controls. I think R1 is our shorter melee, and R2 is our heftier one. L1 is block. L2 is also block. Square did that, uh, what I'm assuming was an emote, maybe? Okay. L is our dodge and roll, which roll should be, uh, something we do often. Oops. Okay. So let's get out of here. Right stick is camera controls. We figured that out. And RB is attack. Yes, it is it is tagged with LGBTQIA because I identify that way. And it's a very inclusive space, so everybody is welcome. Strong attack. I hear something pretty big coming up. I feel bad attacking these people. They didn't do anything. But we are getting souls. Okay, so left stick and O to dash. Oh, you're gay, says guy. Um, so I just label myself as queer. Um, if it needs to get more specific, then I would say bisexual. Um, I would not say that I am cis. I would say I'm more so probably somewhere along the gender non-conforming spectrum. I've said transmasculine in the past, but I feel like it's kind of changed over time. But thank you for asking. Okay. So RS, is that our left button press or our right button press? I can't remember. Okay, it looks like it's our right. This may or may not hinder us in the future. I'm not sure. Good stuff. Thanks. It is good stuff. I am a firm believer of the uh, Kinsey scale. I feel like people, you know, people can be comfortable with whatever they want to do, but sometimes I do think that people limit themselves a lot. All right, where are we going here? I don't know why we are walking so slowly now too. Uh, Pod says, still more intuitive controls than in Nintendo controllers where you apply the right button instead of the bottom one. Yep. Kinsey scale of good stuff, that too. Um, I apologize if there are going to be points where I can't keep up with chat because I can't pause this game and there might be parts that are a bit uh, intensive, so I do apologize ahead of time. I try to keep up as best I can. We're doing okay so far, but I remember this part was uh, pretty easy because it's pretty cinematic from what I can remember. Um, the other thing I was going to say too, I mean obviously I think a lot of people who are here are familiar with Souls games and how they work in general, but if you see a bonfire that is a resting point for us where we can restart our, uh, well, regenerate our HP and we can save and change some gear and stuff like that, but the issue is that say you're going around defeating a bunch of enemies, when you come back to that point and relight the bonfire, all those enemies will regenerate too. So sometimes it's kind of a toss up in terms of, do you want to rest here and, you know, restart everything? Or do you want to just keep going? Um, for me, I have to just rest there because I don't know, otherwise I'm going to die. And I feel like grinding is a pretty big part of this game too, in terms of saving up souls and leveling up. I don't know if it's worth it to uh, break all these paths. Not sure. Okay, we're gonna be busy. With our little broken sword. It's okay. Well, from what I recall, <laughs> from what I recall, I think we're supposed to die in this part. Should have named him Link. Yeah, that's a good one too, Mad Queen. Yeah, if this is gonna be uh, any indication of the future, our future fights, this is how it's gonna go. Awesome, awesome, awesome.
thanks everybody for the hype train. Super appreciate it. Did my memory serve me incorrectly? Uh, oh. <laughs> Hold on. I will allow that. Apologies. Whoa, camera's going all over the place. So, Shen said Dark Souls linked to the pissed. That's right. Did I... Did I misremember? Are we actually supposed to defeat that thing with a broken sword? Or maybe just survive? I can't remember. Stamina goes out super quick, too. Upon entering the room with that boss, follow the left wall to a doorway that you can slip through. Okay, I must have misremembered. My bad. But thanks for reminding me. Also, for those who may have not played a Dark Souls game before either, um, when you die and you come back to the spot where you died, you have a chance of grabbing the souls that you had already collected previously. So that's a nice little plus. So let's see if I can find them. They are around. Oh, you have to kill it, but you can get a better weapon than the broken straight sword. Yikes. Okay. It has been a while. Maybe I forgot what I'm supposed to do. Just don't listen to me. That's the usual advice here. Just don't listen to me. Well, I will always take advice. Oh shoot. I just want this. I just want that. <laughs> Open the door. It's locked. Folks, the door's locked. You said left side, right? Left side, left side. It's over here by the torches. Yes. Okay. Whew. Take that, scary guy. Degen, I love those emotes. Those are great. Alright. So let's keep... Oops. Let's keep going. Bonfire lit. Is there a shield in here? This game is so dark. I think it's not as bad as Kingdom Come. Ooh. Right in the chest. That's a good start. We don't have a shield, do we? Uh, change equipment? Nope, we got nothing. Gen for all the emotes. Alright, I guess we're just gonna have to do some ducking maneuvers. Back here. Wow, he really ran off. Ooh, broadsword. Change equipment. I not grab it? I'm uncomfortable because I'm hearing something trying to shoot us, I think. So let me run back down here real quick. Um. Oh, now we got a shield. Okay. So let me go here where I think it's safe. Oops. Yep, we saw that already. And change equipment. Broadsword. Shield. There we go. Now we're fighting ready. Ooh, Bagel, I love those emotes too. Where'd you folks get all these nice emotes? Change weapons, toggle items. How do we hold up our... Ah, uh, here we go. Should have known. Oh, that was from the hype train. Nice. Take that, you jerk. We did it. Let me see. Uh... Yeah, we don't... Where's our Estus flask? Oops. No, it's not what I want. I just want to... There we go. 
Do we really not have an Estus flask yet? Hmm. Find that a bit odd. Traverse with the white light. You know, it's funny because people always talk about, like, Souls game clones. I wonder how From Software felt when they were first making this type of gameplay. Like, how well they thought it was going to be received. Oh, I hoped that maybe we could break that wall. But I guess not. Estus flasks are for closers. Do you mean losers? In which case, I am not degen. question for me is, well, question for you folks is, uh, was there a Dark Souls game before Dark Souls? Like, was there a similar type? Oh, people who close deals? Okay. If you say so. Demon Souls. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's the same company. That's fair, Pod. It's the same company, but... Was there a game like that before uh, From Software started doing it? I'm already really bad with directions in games, too. Uh, even with a map. So without a map, it's going to be more tricky for us. But now we have a shortcut, which is sweet. Uh, Fantasy World Dizzy for the Commodore 64. Not familiar with that. I know I've already respawned all the enemies, but this year's is a remake. Right, yeah. There was Demon Souls first. The one that came out this year was a remake for that for the PS5 release. But I just meant in general, like you get what I'm saying, right? That there's so many people that are like, oh, this is a Souls like, this is a Souls like, and I have to wonder. Oh, holy <laughs> Should have seen that coming. I have to wonder if there was any game like that before. How did that happen? How did you manage to handle a big boulder like that? My gosh. Oh, that was painful. I could feel that in my soul. That was something. And you know, the thing is too, like, Usually if I play these games, it's a much more meditative experience for me, where I'm just playing them quietly so I feel like I can focus a little bit better. But now that oh, I'm chatting, you. forget about it. You're no hollow. Thank goodness. I'm done for, I'm afraid. I'll die soon, then lose my sanity. Feel it in your dark soul? Something. Absolutely, Mad Queen. You and I, we're both undead. Hear me out, will you? Oh, shoot. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Mad Queen, your jokes are always welcome here. And Shen said, I at least don't know of one that was quite this combination of mechanics. Yeah, I have to agree. I have to agree. That's why I was just asking, because I was curious. I don't have, like, a super big game history. Um, Djen said, I assume he used a fulcrum and a lever. That is how he managed to move that boulder. I didn't see anything. Um, if my memory serves me correctly, I feel like this guy wants us to kill him. But... I'm trying to remember what I did last time. Hmm. I think I'll go with no, and hopefully that won't. Uh, yes, I see. Perhaps I was too hopeful. Hopefully that won't bog anything down. Please leave me be. I have not long to live, and I may harm you after death. I wonder now, if you'll become like go. a really super enemy when we're in this area later. Hmm. Oh, so that wall I was trying to hit. That's where our boulder has gone. Gotcha, gotcha. Making shortcuts. So, okay, downstairs was our shortcut. Upstairs, I think we already explored everything up here, didn't we? This was our boulder guy. This door was locked. Sorry, sometimes I just have to talk out loud to 
understand. D gem. That's such a cute emote too. Love it. I heard something over here. It sounded like a sword. That's not a sound I want to hear. Uh, okay. Not that way. Not that way. The thing that really bothers me about these games, too, well, I guess it's not a complaint, it's just more of like a fear factor for me, is we're so gosh dang loud. Maybe I should have been that bear in person with no clothes. Then we could stealth everywhere. All right, there's gotta be a way down here, right? Oh no, we were already down there. Where are we going? <laughs> oh, only like 20 minutes into gameplay and I'm already lost. Okay, let's see. So there's gotta be a way around up there. Do you think we have to kill that guy to get a key? That's like the only hint that my mind has. I think that may be the case. Because we already went through... We came from that way. And that's just a wreck. Although there is something in there. <laughs> Shen says, you could take the armor off, but then you wouldn't be very knightly. True. True, Shen. Yay, our Estus Flask! I don't want to use that by accident. I feel like that was an issue for me last time. Use item is X, which is our square PlayStation controller. Yeah. And resting at the bonfire also regens our flask, which is great. No, we don't want to go down there. I mean, up there. We want to go down here. Let's visit our person again. No. Shoot. I'm telling you. I get so lost. Hold on. Where was our person? Ooh. Okay, we got a key. How did I miss that before? Alright, well, let's go to our door. Okay, so if we press triangle, we can use our two-handed grip. Kick and jump attack. I don't remember that being a thing. Oops. That doesn't seem right. I hope I'm not killing uh, the durability of our weapon. I can't remember if that's a thing in this game. I also tend to swing really wildly in these games, so I'm gonna have to quickly unlearn that uh, tendency. We're okay, we're okay. See, like, I did three extra swings there. I just tend to button mash. While falling to do a plunging attack. Okay. I don't think I'm ready to go into that door yet. Let's see. Ooh, if we get behind an enemy, we can do a critical hit. Nice, nice. I'm also historically bad with parrying. Um, I can definitely try. I can definitely try. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh, I thought we could get behind him. Oh, he's still alive! I didn't use my, uh, locking thing either. Love the ragdoll mechanics. Okay. It's locked. Shoot. Well, it sounds like we're gonna have to go into, uh... The spot here. Maybe I'll take a shot of the flask. Go ahead and do that. 
Degen says, I usually just assume parrying doesn't exist. I too am historically bad at parrying. Yeah. Understandably so. <sighs> Let's do it. Oh! Oh, I had a chance! I had a chance to do our uh, falling attack. Time to drink the flask. Oh man. We'll get it. I know we will. Just gotta try, try again. That's our usual motto. Only problem is. I can't remember exactly how to get there. Is our boulder gonna fall down again? No. Okay. Still managed to get us. Nice. Okay. Have to remember my uh, plunge attack. Look at him just looking at us, waiting for us to come. Holy! He decided to meet us first. I don't like that. Give you a second to just take a sip. Yikes. dodging around too much, but I just get scared. Oh, there's our souls. I can't get distracted by that right now, though. How did I still get hurt by that? That's bogus. That was understandable. land right on us. That was not a good time. Please. No. <laughs> no. Invasion 100 boss is quite acrobatic. Yeah. He's very acrobatic for being so big. Weep, I did not deserve that uh, cheer. Gotta put a rule on it. You can't cheer unless I do something good. I appreciate the encouragement. So thanks for that. Oh, yikes. I'm telling you, this might be all that we see this stream. There can be cheeky cheers? I guess so. Cheeky cheer. Not using the shield. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Degen, you're full of good ideas. Go two handed instead of using the shield. Oh, shoot, we still got the arrow in us. It's a bad time. Weep is the king of cheeky chairs. Okay. We 
don't uh, have as much health as I would like to, but we're gonna go for it. Stab him! Yeah, that was pretty good. That was not good. Stop rolling around! You gotta drink! Hey, run, 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 run. want to stick to the plunging attack that we did. I feel like that was probably the most damage we did to this guy so far. King of cheeks. Sorry for the repetitive nature of this. I'm trying my best, dang it. Hey, we did our kick attack. chance this time. Yes! We did it. Woohoo! Excellent. Excellent, excellent. Sometimes wonky hitboxes are a good thing. Absolutely. I still hear something big stomping around, so that's not great. We retrieved some souls. Hopefully nothing bad happens, because otherwise we're going to be pretty upset. Aw, thank you again for the cheer. Wonderful. We use the big pilgrim's key. I have a feeling we're gonna see something much worse here. Even though it's such a grim world, it's so, so pretty. Good job, go straight ahead. I feel like this is uh, trolling us already. I'm sure there's nothing else to check out. I'm gonna feel really bad if uh, I'm gonna roll down a hill and die. That would not be ideal. Well, that didn't take as long as I thought it was going to, so that's a relief. And I think, Bleep, this is the part that we talked about just yesterday. 